Okay, here's problem 20. Radiant uh, function is given by this. So we have the derivative when x equals 0 and y equals 8. And then find the value of y. Okay, so we want to find the original function. And I'm assuming they mean that on the original function we have a point 0 and 8. They don't, it's kind of unclear the way this is written. So this is just like the last problem, number 19. So we want to find the antiderivative. So um, my antiderivative, I'm going to keep my 10. e to the 2x, the antiderivative is e to the 2x. But then we need to multiply by um, 1 half here. Somebody has a question. Can you ask Jeff? And then plus C. Okay, so the reason why I know that this is this is because if I do the derivative of one half e to the two x, e to the two x times the derivative of two x, which is two, two times one half is one, one times ten. Okay, so now we need to substitute in h. Thank you. No problem. Uh, 10 times 1 half is 5, e to the 2x is 0, minus 5 times 0, plus c. 1 times 0 is 0, e to the 0 is 1, 5 times 1 is 5, 5 times 0 is 0, plus e, so 8 equals 5 plus c, minus 5, c is equal to 3, so my, what was I trying to do? Trying to find the gradient function. What am I trying to do? Y. Y equals this. That's funny. I wrote down something Oh, find the value of y when x is 1. Okay, so y equals, I write down my function. This is 5 e to the 2x minus 5x plus 3. Now I want to find out what is y when x is 1. So what is y when x is 1? So I had to find the original function first, and now I need to substitute x into 1. y is equal to e to the 2 times what is 2, so that's 5e squared. Minus 5 plus 1. So y is equal to 5 e squared minus 2. There. Number 1.